I think you can take bits out of it for sure. Um, you, know, you saw a guy making his test debut running a line out very effectively. Um, yeah, you, you saw that leadership can come from within the group across the board, that, uh, that guys just, not seamlessly, but they can, they can fit into a system and, and work hard. And I think the endeavour that was present in the first half, probably that's where we reap the second half rewards, I think, um, because it allowed us to keep the pressure on them throughout most of the first 40 minutes. And, uh, and that valve was bound to burst at some stage, or, or, or we certainly hoped it would. Were you pleased with the first half performance, Yeah, I, I, I was pretty pleased with the first half performance. It would have been nice to finish off a couple of those uh, those efforts close to the line. And I think if you, you know, whenever you're playing big teams, if you miss those opportunities, I think we saw that last weekend. Um, you know, that, that can come back and, and haunt you a bit at the end of the game. But um, we we manufactured the opportunities. We kept the pressure on them. Uh, and that forced them sometimes to make uh, a, n a number of errors around the ruck. I think there were probably seven or eight ruck penalties in the first half. So, you know, that starts to accumulate in, uh, in the sense that they, they will pick up a, a more serious sanction and, and that will allow us a little bit more uh, opportunity. Well, on that side, how did you enjoy coming up? Yeah, very much so. I think uh, the last 60 seconds of the first half probably summed up you know, a lot of things which we try and do. We um, obviously gave a penalty away in one of the killer situations that Joe was talking about, trying to score a try. They kicked it out and uh, we defended a line out. You know, close to half time, people might be thinking the half is over and we managed to steal a line out, get back up the pitch, get a penalty, kick it so we're more than a score ahead and one of their guys goes in the bin. And I think that probably was a key point in the game. I think it's it's part of the attitude we try and play every second as it comes. and. Thought it was good from the lads um, to not drop the head when we gave that penalty away when we could have scored to actually get back in the game straight away and uh, and not let that get to us. Morning. Joe, the IRB say you are now third in the world rankings. Is that a fair reflection? Yeah, apparently. <laughs> really? Yeah. Ah. Uh, fair reflection of where you are and the greatest team you've been. I think it's um, I think it's a distraction. I don't think I don't think that. We can win anything by saying we're third in the world. We just have to probably tidy up our scrum a bit, get our set piece right, and and um, and just try to get those those practical things right. I, I think it's fantastic uh, if if that's the case. Um, I think it is a, a feather in the cap of the lads who've rolled their sleeves up for the last 12 months. Um, but yeah, I, I can't say it's something we'd be talking about or or even aware of. Um, so, yeah, you can see Reds is delighted. <laughs> <laughs>